the mark of the beast, the 144,000, the identity of the Antichrist, Armageddon. What does it all mean? Today, end time expert Ron Rhodes helps us to navigate through the book of Revelation and what's ahead on Jewish Voice. Let's go into some specifics. Talk about the number seven, which occurs numerous times in Revelation. Well, it's interesting. The word seven, uh, you know, you've got seven churches in Revelation 2 and 3. You've got seven trumpet judgments and seven seal judgments and seven bowl judgments. You've got the seven spirits. You've got uh, Jesus being described as the lamb with seven eyes and seven horns. So what is all this about? Well, the word seven, the number seven, indicates completeness or perfection. And, uh, for example, when you read about seven trumpet judgments, that indicates complete judgment. God will exercise complete judgment against the unbelievers who live during the tribulation period. When we read about the Lamb of God that has seven eyes, that means perfect omniscience. Christ sees everything. It's a symbolic way of describing the fact that Christ, as the Lamb of God, sees all. And uh, the Lamb of God is also said to have seven horns. Now, horns in the Bible indicate power. Just like an animal that has a couple of horns, that indicates that that animal is a powerful mm -hmm. animal. So in that same sense, whenever you read the word horn in Bible prophecy, it indicates power. So the lamb, which has seven horns, means that he is all-powerful. 